What's up, everybody? Jason Welch, J Dub Detailing. Um, it's uh, July 20th, 2017. Just pulled up to that job. You know, this one that I work at all the time, all night. Uh, just want to bring you up to speed. You know, things have been a little crazy. You know, I found a shop in um, Salt Lake, and I was like, man, this is awesome. This guy it is an abandoned building, been there for three years. No one's ever rented from there, at least. And I found the owner, and I was like, yeah, you want to do this? He's like, yeah, yeah, you want to do it? Uh, 1140, we'll build out how you want to spec or whatever. And I was like, oh, tight. I was like, all right, let's figure it out. Well, lo and behold, some other people, maybe, came to them and said uh, they were interested, but they wanted to take two shops. And I'm just, I wasn't, wasn't ready for that. I said, you know, you can put that in the contract, whatever, that I'd do it in March, but I don't want that right now. So, uh, but he ended up taking these other guys after he was saying that he would lease to me. So, I mean, there's a silver lining in it. Like, this dude backed out of this verbal agreement. Like, we go ahead and do it. But because someone else showed up and wanted more money, he decided to take that. Um, I don't have the rent from that guy now. That's cool. Uh, so, I started, you know, coming back to work and trying to get the focus on there. You know, um, my current work, they gave me, you know, they gave me that raise. And, um... I just thought that I'd just start working here and just keep doing the detailing from home. But what I've been seeing is I'm losing a lot of customers and I can't accommodate to their needs and their wants and their times and all that stuff. And so when I can't accommodate to them, uh, it's hurting them and it's hurting me. And it's, I mean, I want a name that's solid and uh, known for the quality and known for the, you know, for, uh, for prices and for the time and accommodations and, and all that good stuff, you know, and I, and I can't do that when I'm just working Saturday and Sunday. Plus, like, you need a day off. You need to give a day off to yourself. And, um, so anyways, I went back, I'm, you know, I've been driving around looking for shops and looking for shops afterwards, you know, I was a little depressed over that one. Because I had even told my work again, I was like, hey, I'm, I'm out. And then, uh, because that guy backed on me, I had to call back and be like, uh, just kidding. <laughs> my work here they had they had made me some uh they did a potluck like a going away and then it turned to being like a thank you for staying type thing and man it's an emotional roller coaster but uh here's the funny thing is i went back to this shop that i first seen that made me want to do this and the guy still had a lease sign on it. It's just not on KSL. And so my wife got a hold of him during the time I was at work and said, hey, my husband wants this. And he's like, oh, cool, because I was about to do some advertising for it. So needless to say, 3.30 um, on Sunday, I go to sign a lease. And he said he'd even do a build-out suit or whatever. So um, I'm leaving this place, this place that I that I hate. I love the people. I love the job. But I hate here. Uh, there's just so many, uh, so many loopholes and so many like inconsistencies. The most consistent thing here is the inconsistencies. <sighs> oh, look at that little, what do you call that? A calic? Calic in my beard? bald spots on my face <laughs> give a damn uh, so stay tuned you know if you if you've been watching all these videos you can see that there's been lots of things going on and uh it's fun and I just got back from Vegas went and spent the weekend out there with my wife and damn it, we had some fun we had a lot of fun ah <sighs> so bad day can tell these guys about if you didn't, if you need me to translate that, that's on Monday I get to come in here and tell these guys that I'm out. Peace.
cool thing about it, it's going to be in late. It's going to be closer to home. Um, there's not as many people, but word of mouth travels fast. And I just believe that if I'm good and I'm doing good and I want good and I want nothing but good for other people, that good will come my way. Hopefully tenfold. Hmm. One million dollars. Sorry. I'm a nut. I gotta get in here. These guys are gonna wonder where I'm at. No, they're not. I'm early. I'm always early. Alright, guys. Have a good day. Stay tuned.